Good morning, everybody. Thanks for tuning in to the Champagne Hour, the podcast for female creatives, entrepreneurs, and leaders. With all of the talk about artificial intelligence, changes in the digital ecosystem, and what this looks like in business, I want to welcome you to the first solo episode of 2023. For those of you guys who have no idea who I am, I'm your host, Sierra Renee. I have a background in tech, science, and digital marketing. I created the Champagne Hour to ultimately help empower other women to step up in their everyday lives and career through authentic inspo. So we're talking to the women who are in the arena, getting their hands dirty, and making waves on the internet to dissect their career trajectory, what exactly made them successful up to this point, and what advice they have for others looking to do the same. Today, we're talking about ways to maximize our digital impact this year. As a branding and marketing expert, here are some things I think female leaders should know right now. In the upcoming year, I would say that we should focus on the power of community, especially for businesses. We aren't the only ones saying this. But after a certain volatile period in our everyday lives, we got shaken up. I'm sure you guys have not forgotten what that period is called, right? But we see a lot of human beings craving that personal connection. Basic economics teaches us supply and demand, right? So the best way that I can frame this prediction is that the supply of intimacy has seen a rapid decline. Therefore, the need to create more of this has come forth. We think that companies will thrive more when they find ways to curate interactive experiences for their audiences, which will bring them closer together. Number two is to harness the power of AI. Who hasn't heard of ChatGPT, Claudia, and other artificial intelligence tools that are storming the web right now? It's crucial to be aware of the constant changes in tech. Most people think that artificial intelligence and learning is here to overtake them. Not yet. However, there's a good chance that these new tools can make room for even more automation, which is a good thing. Whereas you had to pay X amount of dollars for a certain service, we see that AI is reducing those costs. This matters because we will be watching firms scale faster at less of a cost. And if you haven't read our article on Medium and AI, about AI and the stats behind the changes that it's bringing to business, we'll link that below so that you guys can go ahead and check that out. The third tip that we have is to double down on UGC. User-generated content, also known as UGC, will continue to be a pop and trend for 2023. Finding ways to spotlight how actual users are enjoying products or services will garner more trust, which is one of the keys to selling online. Ensure that you're keeping track of genuine reviews, leaving an open space or forum for people to talk about what you sell, and are actively pursuing opportunities to share your brand. A popular way that we will see this show up going forward are digital ambassadors. So we think that society is more likely to see digital influencers who represent companies within metaverse spaces as well. And this is something to possibly look out for and even get in on in the future. Number four is niche related or signature content. We feel like niche related or signature content is queen. okay? One thing my folks and I will continue to stress over at the Media House is the establish of signature content. And what we mean by this is brands who have an identifiable visual identity are more likely to gain loyal followers. Creating something that others can relate to, stand for, or with really matters right now because people are no longer seeking extremely broad and generalized content. They're looking for someone or a group of someones who speak to their passion, who speak to their soul. So most want a tailored experience that makes them feel like your creation was made especially for them. 
because as you grow in business and as the ecosystem changes, you'll be doing exactly that. So this is why creating unique content that touches on how you serve your people will, will fare well. That's what we've got for now, coming straight from the media house. Thank you guys so much for tuning into this episode. Let us know what you digital babes think and what trends you are looking forward to seeing online. Wishing you the absolute best. XO, Sierra Renee.